In this video, we discuss about the basics of web scraping. So in very simple terms, web scraping is a process of downloading data from websites. Now, why is this important? It's important due to two reasons. One, access to data is critical for the success of most businesses in these times. So no matter which field you are in, marketing, sales, machine learning, academic research, data is important. And two, most of the websites do not provide a direct method, an easy way to download the data which they display because it's against their interests. But at the same time, extracting this data which is available in the public domain is completely legal. So be it an e-commerce website like Amazon which displays product listings, thousands or millions of them, or be it a real estate website like Silo where you can get property details or agent or owner contact details or yellow pages directories or even Google Maps which displays local business information including their contact details or reviews or, and ratings. All of these websites just display the data. They don't provide a method to download this data. So web scraping is the process which enables you to download this data which are displayed by these websites into a tabular format which can be saved into a database or a file usually in spreadsheet format. Now web scraping is used in many areas as we discussed before. It's used in marketing for lead generation. It's used in e-commerce for price comparison and monitoring. It's used in real estate. It's used in machine learning for uh, collecting data for testing and training machine learning models. It's used in academic research, market research. So then how can we perform web scraping? There are two methods. First is by using a web scraping software. And the second method is to write your own code. Now this is applicable only if you are a developer. If you are a developer or if you hire a developer, there are various web scraping APIs and libraries using which you can write your own specific a software for your own requirement but in case you are not a developer you can use a web scraping software which lets you do the same task now there are two types of web scraping software one is a cloud-based software which you can access uh, via the browser examples are octopus and parse hub and then there are locally installable web scraping software which you can install in your uh, computer locally and perform web scraping now the pros and cons of the cloud versus local web scraping solutions is topic for another video but we already have an article discussing in our, in our website which uh, the link to which you can find in the description below. So WebHavi, our own web scraping software is a visual and generic web scraping software uh, which can be used to scrape data from any website uh, with a very point and click intuitive interface. So in case you are interested, go to webhavi.com and try out the scraper. And if you have any questions, please let us know in the comment section below. Thank you.